Frustration is growing among the rebel troops accompanying Rick Machar, who have now been in Gambela for several days waiting to return to Juba. Machar was due to return to the capital on Monday to take up the post of the first vice president alongside arch rival President Salva Kiir, but differences over security arrangements in Juba delayed his arrival. The government had on Thursday agreed to Machar's demand to travel with 195 soldiers, each carrying the individual light arms, as well as 20 rocket-propelled grenade launchers and 20 machine guns. The 195 troops were scheduled to travel to Juba today to join the 1,370 soldiers who arrived last week in accordance with the peace deal. Now, the government of Sudan has said it will only clear Machar to land in Juba after international monitors verify the number of weapons carried by the rebel troops accompanying him. His failure to arrive has thrown into jeopardy an August 2015 peace deal to end over two years of intense civil war. Machar, who has repeatedly been delayed in his attempt to return to Juba, is now expected next week. Asli Galgalo, Citizen Weekend.